Hey guys, I'm Mr. Baldwin, and I'm here with... Maggie, Avni, Shannon. And we're going to be uh, learning about hardness today, one of the other uh, mineral properties that we can use to help identify some of these minerals. As we saw in the other videos, it's just one of the variety of tests we can do. We don't have to use all of them, but it's just one that you can use to help figure out what type of mineral it is. So, I'm going to start with a question for you guys. When your teacher writes on a chalkboard, what's harder, the chalk or the chalkboard? The board. The board. Yeah, what would happen if the chalk was harder? The crack or... Yeah, you'd crack the chalkboard, right? And it'd be totally useless. And okay? well, there's a reason we do that, okay? Um, so what we want to do is we want to make sure that we're using the hardness of a mineral to be our best advantage. So, let's look at the definition. So if we take a look, the hardness it's simply the resistance of a mineral to scratching. Okay, so we want to see how easily or hard, how difficult it is for something to be scratched. We use a couple tools. We use some easy stuff like our fingernails, and we use pennies, and we use these glass plates, and we use our streak plates from before, and then some nails or files. Okay, so I'm going to ask you guys, which one do you think is the softest out of this group? So we've got fingernails, pennies, glass, nails, or streak plate. Which one's the softest? The plate. Think the plate's the softest? So the Maybe. easiest to scratch? Maybe. No, 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 the glass, the glass. Glass is easiest to scratch. Maybe. Maybe, okay. Well, how would we figure out which one's harder, my fingernail or the, gra the glass? How could we figure out which one's harder? Scratch it. Scratch it, right? Okay. Let me get a nice black background for you here. So, I can take my fingernail. Luckily, I just got my nails did. So, does it look like my fingernail is scratching that glass? No. No. And that would be a bad thing if my fingernails could scratch glass, because if I did that on a window, it would be all, I'd be breaking the glass. Now, how could I figure out if the glass is harder than my fingernail? Scratch your nail. Try and scratch my nail, okay? So make sure you don't get your nails did right before this. But if you take a look... What's, describe what's happening to my fingernail. Do you guys see what I'm doing? It's getting yeah. streaked. Yeah, it's kind of streaking, right? Okay, so what am I breaking? Am I breaking my fingernail or am I breaking the glass? Your nail. Your nail. Breaking my nail, right? So which one's harder, the glass or my nail? The glass. The glass is harder, okay? So that basic way of doing that is how we're going to figure out the hardness for each of these, okay? So let's say I took this streak plate and this glass. Which one do you think is harder? Plate? Okay, so how can I figure this out? Scratching it. Okay. Is it breaking the glass? Okay, so one way we can test too is we can take the streak plate and we can try and make a nice little scratch. I hope you can see it on the camera. What do you see on the glass plate? Scratches. Little scratches, right? So which one's harder? Streak plate or the glass? The glass. Plate. You're the plate. Why is the plate harder? You're right. Because um, <laughs> it scratches the glass. Because it scratches the glass. Okay, that's like the basic property we need. Whatever scratches the other thing is going to be harder. Okay? So, let's start looking at some minerals first. Okay, let's start, I think, with this one. Okay? Take a feel of it. Do you think it's a really hard or a really soft mineral? I'm just getting to know her mineral. <laughs> soft. It's very soft. Oh, it's like falling apart on the table, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, so, do you think your fingernail is going to be able to scratch it? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, oh no. You broke it. What'd you do? Oh, my nail is <laughs> harder than this mineral. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. So, your nail's harder than this mineral. So, what we can do is we can use that to help give this a number, okay? So, if we take a look at our lab manuals again, this is going to be a really useful tool for us. We're using a scale called the Mohs Scale of Hardness. So, all it is, is each of these tools that we have. So our fingernails, the pennies, the streak plates, the glass plates, the uh, nails, and the file. All of them have a set number. So, like, if we look on our piece of paper over here, what is the hardness of our fingernail? 2.5. 2 2.5, okay. So, is our number going to be higher or lower than 2.5? For the mineral? Yeah. Lower. Lower. Good. So I know that this hardness of this mineral is going to be lower than 2.5. Okay? Ready for another one? Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's try this one. Avni, you got this one. 
All right, so does it feel hard or soft? Hard. Kind of hard, right? Mm -hmm. Do you think you can scratch it with your finger now? A little bit. A little bit. So is the mineral breaking? No. I mean, there's powder. It's powdering, right? Yeah. Okay, so what's harder, fingernail or the mineral? The mineral. The mineral. Good. So now both of these... Oh, sorry. I just did that backwards. Uh, yeah, you're right. The, the fingernail should be harder. Okay, because okay? it's scratching the middle, right? Yeah. Okay, sorry. Miss Lawai just gave me a really funny look from behind the camera. Okay, so now I've got two minerals that are softer than the fingernail. How do you think I could figure out which one's softer than the other one? Scratch it against each other. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Try it out. See which one's softer. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Well, isn't it pretty obvious if you know that this one's softer than the nail and then this one's harder, then this one's going to be softer than this mineral? Mm, okay. Cool, so that one's breaking this one, so we know that this mineral is softer, okay? Let's do another example. Uh, how about you walk us through this one? That's harder. Okay, so the it's mineral's, mineral's harder. harder than your fingernail. Yeah. So I know it's greater than 2.5. Yeah. What should I use next on the list? Penny. Good, so take a penny. It's a little bit powder. Okay, so a little bit powder. One of the best ways you can do this too, if you're not quite sure, try and find a pointy edge on the mineral. So like here's a nice pointy edge and find a nice soft spot or flat spot on the penny. Did you see what happened to my penny there? Yeah. Yeah, it scratched it, right? Mm -hmm. So the mineral's harder. Okay, so what should I go to next on my table? Skip Screw. the brass. We don't have the brass. <laughs> Nail? Yeah, so we'll take an iron nail. So what's being scratched? Mineral. The mineral's being scratched. So, based on that, we know it's softer than a nail, but harder than a penny. Yeah. So let's look to our table here. What's going to be the hardness? Four. Okay, so I just know it's softer than the nail, mm -hmm. but harder than the penny. So I'm just going to estimate. It's between 2.9 and 4.5. We give it a range because we're not exactly sure if it's 4, if it's 3.2, somewhere in the middle. Okay? Should we do another one? Sure. Alright, let's go with this one. You got this one. Alright. So first my nail, right? Mm -hmm. Alright, the mineral is harder and then the penny. And the penny. The mineral is still harder. And Minerals. then the nail, right? Then the nail, yeah. And the mineral is still harder. Still harder. So what do we do after the mineral? Or sorry, the nail. Okay. Um, the glass. Could do the glass, yeah. Be careful with the glass too. You don't want to go shattering pieces all over. All right, it's kind of deteriorating a little. What's it? The mineral or the, the glass? The 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 mineral. Okay. Well, let's take a look. One of the best ways to do it. Wait, no. Just kidding. Ooh. It's the glass. Oh my gosh. And if you're ever not sure, try it the other way. So take the mineral and try and scratch the glass. Okay, and you should see that little scratch mark in there. Okay. So if I know the mineral is harder than the glass, what should I go to next? Streak plate. Streak plate. So see if it scratches the streak plate. Is this mm -hmm. one? Okay. <laughs> do we do it this way or I'll just try it? Um. What do you think? Okay. You tell us. You've got it. <laughs> <laughs> um. The. I think it's. The, the plate is deteriorating. Okay, so the plate's deteriorating? Yeah. Okay, so again, if you're never quite sure, one of the best ways is just put the plate on the ground and try and break it. And you should feel kind of a little bit of like a groove in there because you're breaking the streak plate. And this one, you're actually deteriorating or you're breaking some of this mineral. So this should be harder than the streak plate. Okay? Oh, sorry, did I just say that backwards again? Oh my gosh, Miss Awad. So, uh, the mineral should be softer because the mineral is breaking down, okay? So, I know that it scratched the glass, but it didn't scratch the street plate. So, it'll be between 6.5 and 5.5, .5. okay? You guys ready to try one more?
-hmm. Give you guys a nice, should I be mean to him? No, I'll be nice. Try this one. So my nail first. Perfect. Your nail's harder. Okay. So what's the hardness of it? Less than two. Right? Less than two point five. Two point five. Perfect. And what does that one actually look like? What's it look like on your fingers? Like black. Kind of like black. See if you can write on the paper with it. Um. Uh, write your name. <laughs> there you go. It's like a pencil. It's like a pencil. Yeah, it's graphite. That's one of the reasons why we use graphite. It's because it's softer than the paper. Mm -hmm. Okay? Cool. You guys have any questions? No? Feeling good? Yeah. All right. Cool. That's all we got for you guys. Uh, she's got a new toy now here. <laughs> okay? Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys in class. Bye. Bye.